most of them don't really get the experience of the river, and no one really experiences a paddle wheel boat because there's so few of them left around, you know. It's a, just a unique thing we have here. We are an authentic paddle wheeler, you know. There's probably less than a dozen of these left in the United States. You know, the, grand, the grandest showboat of them all, and everybody wanted to ride it. You know, we were, we were bringing 1,100 people a cruise on here, four cruises a day, every day of the week. It was really, it was really booming. They have high standards for quality, obviously, on the boat, you know, from the service to the uh, product, to the show, to the dinners, to the lunch that they're going to have now. Uh, it's, it, they maintain a high standard, and they keep it, you know, and they work hard to maintain it constantly, you know. Uh, uh, 30 years ago, they, they, they did, they represented country music and music in general as it was, but they still kept the heart and soul of the traditional side uh, alive, and we continue to do that today. Well, I actually got my start because uh, when Opryland built this boat, they didn't have a crew on staff that could staff it, you know, man it. So they went to Ingrid Barge Company, it's located here in town, and contracted a navigation crew, and I was part of that original navigation crew, so for the first season, I was an Ingram employee that worked on this boat as a contract, and I was a, a lead deckhand. And uh, after the first season was over with, Opryland offered me a full-time job here, so I actually jumped ship, literally jumped ship, and came over here full-time, been here ever since. I was overwhelmed that night after night, day after day, they would have large groups of people almost sold out all the time that would actually come. To the boat. I, w I was impressed by how they put that together and how many people there actually were to fill up a year of cruising on the General Jackson, you know. Uh, and we, we put together uh, such shows here where it's, uh, it I think it, it's a great representation of what happens in Nashville.